vlogging friends and welcome back to my channel today we are here with the 100 baby gems and it is definitely going to be zircon's birthday we'll probably bake him a cake here and age him up as soon as star comes home well sweetheart you can go ahead and get up and go eat if you like looks like zircon's playing dollies with his mommy so precious and Rosalite, I think she just finished a meal. Let's have her come play. Can she play dolls? Is there not enough space? Not that I don't want her to, to play, but I feel like <laughs> let the kids have room, Gemma. Uh, your fat pregnant ass is uh, taking up space that your daughter <laughs> wants to use the toy. There we go. Come play with dolls, sweetheart. And you can come, does she cook or bake a cake? Okay, we can bake a cake. Cook a cake, that is. Okay, I think we're gonna do a strawberry cake. <laughs> She's just like eating her eggs and toast. There we go, into the oven. Oh, oh my gosh, did you guys just see that? Her tummy totally just like grew. Oh, she put a cake in the uh, oven and her little bun in her oven responded. <laughs> I wonder if she like just, uh, yeah, she must have just hit her second trimester. And so that was why. Okay, let's go ahead and add birthday candles. Awesome. And then we're going to go ahead and put this in here for a little bit. And we have lots of dishes that need some cleaned up. Okay, <laughs> come let your sister play. <laughs> we gotta take turns uh, with the dollhouse. Yay, Star is home. That means that we can age up Zircon. She's kind of hungry though, but we'll, we'll go ahead and age him up first. Okay, help blow out candles for Zircon. Oh, I'm so excited. This is like our first little birthday of the series. I have to get a picture though, sorry. Come on, there's like no roof. Okay. Time for little Zircon to age up. Here we go. Yay, Zircon. Okay, so he got two social skill points and one in everything else. Let's go ahead and randomize his trait. He is squeamish. And um, I think I wanna go ahead and also randomize the aspirations as well. So let me pull up, I'm just gonna pull up a random gener number generator here on my phone, cause why not? And I'm gonna just do one through four. And we're three, so he's gonna have the motor aspiration. Ah, yay, Zircon! Okay, we're gonna go ahead and add birthday candles. And stick that in the fridge for the next birthday. Alright, little Zircon! What a cutie! Let's go ahead and give you a makeover. Aw, he's such a little cutie pie. Okay, so I'm gonna give him a little makeover and then I'll meet you back here. Alrighty, here's little Zircon. Isn't he just so cute? So this is his everyday outfit. I actually gave him two because I also wanted to give him this cool outfit that came with a like throwback pack. I think that's what it's called. Kit, sorry. Um, and then he has this for his formal wear, athletic, sleepwear, party, swimwear, hot weather, and cold weather. So yeah, I would say he is looking pretty cute. And this is our first child of the series. So exciting. We're gonna have a little Zircon get started on his responsibility by cleaning up his <laughs> uh, toddler poo. No, oh, and he's squeamish. Sorry, Zircon. <sighs> Tough it up, bud. Tough it up. Aw, she wants to celebrate. Oh, she definitely needs a nice shower for sure. And how are the toddlers? Oh, Rosalite needs to be potty trained. Let's 
potty train Rosalite. Oh, Zircon, ew, gross, from Optic Trash. Sorry, buddy. And the nice thing is, is oh, I was gonna say, we have this park over here that has absolutely no uh, toys for him to, to play in. Oh, look at him, he's taking out the trash. What a good guy. Um, oh, he's hungry. Let's have him come get leftovers. Who's calling you? Of course it's Tina. Let's go light fireworks at the Humor and Hijinks Festival. Uh, I think we're going to go ahead and stay home for now and work on some skills. Wow, Zircon's just really taking out all the trash. <laughs> Poor kid. All I needed was for you to take uh, empty the toilet. Didn't have to do anything that crazy. Okay, what are you doing? Checking the toddler. Did Rosalite? Oh, is she changing her diaper? Did she? I don't know what happened. I thought we potty trained her. Oh, poor little Ruby. Come play with your dolls. Oh, <laughs> Zircon's like passed out on the couch. Did you even eat? You funny little guy. Just come eat your food. Okay, so did she read to her? Don't think Rosalite needs to sleep. I just want to be able to read to her. Apparently we're back to eating on the beds. <laughs> yeah, because I'm pretty sure, yeah, she needs to just read to a child for a total of two hours for her aspirations. So if we can work on that, that would be awesome. Now, how are these two coming on their skills? Oh, they're just barely started. Imagination's already level three, but everything else is level one. So Star and Zircon are sleeping. Um, oh, oh, Zircon discovered something stranger's bed, but, oh, that was weird. She was doing something glitchy. Uh, Gemma's helping little uh, Ruby with her flashcards. It looks like we are scared. And is he trying to, yeah, he's trying to wake Star up. Um, I guess we need to get one of those little lights, probably, so that they're not getting scared. I'm surprised that didn't happen in the toddler room. Maybe I already bought one for in there. All right, so we bought the little night light that will hopefully help prevent any future monster issues. Well, try to console him, maybe. I was hoping she could like give him some sort of pep talk. Oh, he's getting so freaked out. <laughs> give him some kind of pep talk like, oh, don't worry. But you guys should definitely become best friends. And then you can feel the baby. Oh no! I guess she can only have one best friend at a time. Okay, sorry. The wife definitely has to be the best friend. I didn't realize you could only have one best friend. Okay, sorry, dear God. We're breaking this best friendship up. We're gonna have lots of babies together. They definitely need to be the best friends. Sorry, Zircon. Is everyone gonna be in sleep at the same time? Wow, that's pretty impressive, I would say. Look at that, everyone's asleep all at the same time. That must be the first time that's happened. <laughs> the kids are all hungry, so they're fending for themselves at this point. <laughs> Oh, the girls are so cute. I love that they're like identical twins. It's the best. So cute. Oh, I didn't even notice. I only gave uh, Ruby socks and not Rose Light. Oh, he needs to go to school. Hurry up. Go to school, Zircon. It's your first day. First day of school. Can't be late. I mean, it's too late. You already are almost an hour late. Come on, Gemma. You should have been on him. How is he supposed to get an A if he's constantly late? Oh, how I love that Rosalite can go to the potty all by herself. <laughs> love that she's independent. Oh no! We must not have paid our bills because I think our power just got shut off. Whoops. Okay. Come. Pay bills. We have the money for it too. I just forgot. Yeah, so they shut off our power. Let's go pay the bills. <laughs> you could bring your bowl of chili outside as you do it. That's fine, Gemma. <laughs> That's fine. Good girl. Yay, power's back on. 
Star Ghana is doing an audit of some community space project voting patterns and discovers that the votes for a recent enacted project were incorrectly counted. Will the public be angry about the community garden instead of a marketplace, or will they not care? Uh, let's be honest. Okay, nice. You got a medium points gain. Awesome. We haven't done a... Oh, look. Our bike is sitting over here. We haven't done a dive for deals in a while, so come do a little bit of that. Girls should be okay for a little while while you do. Oh, <laughs> the lights just doing a cute little dance. Oh, no. Let's not make a mess. How about you come talk to your little drago friend? Actually, she would be better off either doing her movement or her thinking. Or her potty, but she just peed. All right, gems. Keep on diving. Oh, I love it when they hug the little dolly. Go ahead and wander around. You can work on your movement skill. Okay, we found an old little chair. Okay, look. <laughs> One person's trash is another person's treasure. And Gemma, that trash is definitely her treasure. Is there anything else? Nope. You cleared it out. Good girl. Um, go ahead and put the bike in your inventory. And then why don't you come take a shower? Aww. <laughs> you guys are so cute. I love it. Just riding her bicycle into the bathroom. No big deal. She should be having her baby soonish, I think. Let's give you that bath, little Ruby. What do you say? And then Gemma will definitely need to go to the bathroom. <laughs> Apparently she's taking a bath in her slippers. Oh. Bath time! Oh, I love it when they play in the bath. It's so cute. Alright, Zircon's done with school. Okay, he can approve with just a little more effort. I'm sure he could. Um, let's come have him play a little bit of chess to get his fun up, and then we'll have him work on his homework. <laughs> I love it. The toddlers keep eating on the couch, and she eats on their little cushions. <laughs> Oh, Zircon's doing his homework like in the bedroom with it where his sisters are sleeping. Oh, okay, if that's what you want. What is she doing? Oh, nice! I was just gonna have her help and she already chose to do it on her own. Good job, Gemma. Nice! I think Star just got promoted. Yeah, she's construction technician and makes 475 an hour. I really wish that we could do like a fabricator and help her with that. Okay, so it looks like she needs more handiness skill and she needs to interview a homeowner about utilities. Nice, his homework is complete. What is he? Motor skill level two. Ooh, a balanced meal. Someone said eating dirt was okay, but someone else said eating dirt will make you die. Is it okay to eat dirt? Uh, how does it both affect manners? Let's just say it's unhealthy. <laughs> Gemma's just riding her bike inside again. Okay, let's have you... No, go away, Bess. Let's come have you do a confident painting. And let's come have you play chess with your son. <laughs> I love that she just is always wearing her hard hat. It's too cute. Just have uh, Gemma here painting, <laughs> waiting for her to go to, into labor. She should have the baby. Yeah, she should be having the, the baby any time now. What you doing, hon? Oh, did you finish your painting? Why don't you sell that and then you can eat your animal crackers that you felt so inclined to have. Oh no, she's super hungry. Maybe those were supposed to be for uh, her, but that's okay. We're gonna have her eat some mac and cheese. Come eat, little girl, before you get taken away. Oh, I'm surprised we haven't gotten a notification yet. It's a little Rosalite's turn for her bath, cause she's a smelly little toddler. Although she's looking much better now. <laughs> little Rosalite is so cute. Oh my gosh. 
they're getting close to having well not really but they're probably next episode they'll be able to age up the twins and so I don't know if I'm ready they're so cute oh my gosh they're so close so little uh, Rosalite just needs her potty level up to three and then little Ruby needs her potty and her wow her thinking is super low guess we need to work on that. She probably needs some flashcards, which maybe Star can help her out. Why don't you see if you can go potty? <laughs> okay, let's work on that thinking skill since it was a little bit lower and hopefully get it up to level two so she can start doing things on the blocks and whatnot to help her self with her thinking skill. I'm really surprised that Gemma hasn't given birth yet. I felt like she was 24 hours away like in the middle of the day because I swear she was like baking the cake and we were, yeah, and that was like the middle of the day yesterday. So I'm really surprised she hasn't gone into labor. Is she stuck or something? Oh, but that was maybe her third trimester. Okay, darn, so she probably has several more hours left. I think I'm, a, I'm ahead by a little bit. That's okay. I really want her to have this baby this episode, so we'll push through. Aw, Gemma, that's a pretty painting. It like totally matches your colors. How much is it worth? 328? I kind of want to keep it. We have like nothing on our walls anywhere. We'll stick it over here for now. There we go. Okay, paint a new one. <laughs> you guys, Ruby is so stinking close. She's so stinking close to being able to age up. That's okay. I'm not in any huge, huge rush, but definitely next episode, I'm sure she'll be having her birthday. Rosalite's also pretty close. Her potty's a little bit further off, but not that much. But she did max out her imagination skill, so that's pretty awesome. I just now realized that poor Gemma is sick. I didn't even notice the spots on her skin. So let's come have her um, buy stuff. All right, Gemma, let's have you take some medicine. <laughs> so she's medicated from taking medication, but I think, I think we're doing good. Oh, she has idle hands from being a maker. All that painting doesn't count, apparently. Yeah, we do need to get her into doing some juice fizzing or something. Zircon's home. Let's have him come play some chess to get his fun up. Well, 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 Tina. It's been a little while since you've come over. She's been calling, but just not really uh, doing stuff that we can really do. Yay, labor time! All right, Gemma. Go pop them out. Hoping we have more twins. Here we go! Baby number four and maybe five. That'll mean we're halfway through if that's the case. Oh, that's insane. Yay, baby girl! All right, for our name for little baby girl, we're gonna go with Morganite. This was suggested by my friend Amber, who's Simber Sanders. She is the one who made Star. And so, of course, I wanted to um, go with one of her suggestions, but since my name's Morgan, I'm impartial to the name Morganite. So, uh, little baby girl is Morganite. Yay, and we have another girl. So I'm gonna go with Amber's other name suggestion, which was Alexandrite. So two kind of gemstone names for the girls. All right, looks like we have some twin baby girls. Yay, that's so cute. We have two sets of twin girls in a row. I love girls that I in The Sims, like, well, I feel like in general, like not that I have kids in real life, but I feel like I would rather have a girl. Wow. Well, at first I just see them going towards the bed. Oh my gosh. Something tells me Star would not be okay with two lesbos sitting on a bed talking to each other, especially with her not home. Cut it out, ladies. Cut it out. Oh, okay, good. Zircon's here. No, nothing can get done if Zircon's here. 
All right, baby's crying. Let's go ahead and feed and see if we can't stop the crying. All right, you guys, we're gonna go ahead and end this episode here. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, maybe give the video a thumbs up and consider subscribing. Have a wonderful day and happy simming.